these walls have been covered with yellowish primer paint for like 15 plus years too long so i paint them i first went for this denim color on the chimney wall but after um, it dried it looked too purple for my liking so i switched to navy and added some black into it which i think turned out very nice This is our parcel packing corner, which is part of, I guess, the living room area. <laughs> I already had some white paint, but to separate the living room area from the kitchen, which will be white, I wanted the walls to be different color. So I added a few drops of the navy paint into the white and used that on the living room side as the lighter color. Some finishing touches here, and um, I think it looks fine. Even uh, Inspector Doc there approves. The same light grey blue went on the remaining two walls in the living room. That tapestry I actually got uh, way back from Amazon and just stapled it to a frame so it would look a bit more like a painting. I did also put new fabric on this chandelier <laughs> just to clean it up a bit. That's the living room site done, and it turned out quite well for a renovation on a minuscule <laughs> budget. The dog approves. Bit of a setback there, and afterwards the paint roller would stick on the primer and rolling off the undercoat, which just turned into a mess. So I got these uh, cork thingies which clearly needed to be thicker. Now we can stick important stuff to the wall without leaving holes into the wall. The kitchen side, picking off the old vinyl placemats, I guess they were, just to replace them with new equally cheap solution. Um, got these lovely sticker tiles and was too excited to stick them on the wall only to discover I could do a much better job at being accurate making some room, old stuff off, white paint on. I used the same navy color to have as a missing space between the tiles. So off they came and three more packs were ordered. Details do matter. So this time around it took me a whole day to stick them on the wall versus a few hours. Still not perfect, but much better than before. I quite like the optical illusion this uh, pattern gives. It hides all the small imperfections around the outlets and also on the mm, wavy wall. They also kind of match with the wood cabinets and uh, overall warm tones. Definitely better than before. It was quite laborsome to paint the ceiling with uh, this <laughs> small roller and I do have bigger ones but this whole mini renovation took place in between the space still being used for work and living. So whenever there was a few hours to spare I painted a couple of square meters trying my best to keep the mess under control and the room still functional. The water circle took about seven coats of paint to hide. Um, and to be honest, the whole ceiling could use at least one more coat of paint, but it'll do for now. <laughs> this whole process was started by my friends expressing their wish to uh, come see me, which they did one day after the living room was painted. They never knew what they had kickstarted or what took place just a few hours before they arrived. <laughs> 